see how God has blessed us. Blessed All that tears she's sharing is crocodile tears. And this opportunity comes but once. This is the opportunity. I have been married to this woman for 26 years. You know the I'm, pain I've I'm, gone through? Your elder sister's son built a house. They didn't inform you you had it from outside. That's two years that your son has been away. How many of them have given you 20 naira to go and eat? You push should look at me now. I'll be fine woman. But I've been suffering since I got into this man's life. Papa, please no. Calm down now, Papa. I have made up my mind. Please no, Papa. Please to you. You have to. What explanation? Where are you going? Don't you have to tell now, me Papa, the source please, of your Papa. income. Please no, Papa. You cannot just carry me to a house, mansion like this, and just tell me that the house belongs to me and your mother. Papa. I know we have gone through Daddy. a lot. Daddy. Your wife is crying now. Crying? Papa, yeah. see now. <laughs> Mama is crying. Drama. Papa, come now. I married that woman for 26 years now. This boy is 23 years old. I know that woman better than you. Papa, let's go first now. Papa, please. Yeah, let's go. She's acting drama. Papa, let's go first. All that now. tears she's sharing is crocodile tears. Papa. I, I'm telling you the truth. You won't believe me. Papa, please. please. I, I'm telling you the truth. Let's go. Let's go. And let's go uh. now, Papa. Please calm down. You I'm, people I'm... don't know anything. I, I, I might not be the one living in the house with her. I'm the one living inside that house with her. Papa, come. Okay, are you going to tell me that you know my wife better than me? No, Papa, but she's come now. crying now. It's crocodile tears. Are you not hearing me? You, you, you want to make me look like I'm heartless? No, Papa, not come. that. I'm not heartless. Papa, I am not heartless. Papa, no. I see now. I, I, in her front, let me tell you, I know her. I have been married to this woman for 26 years. You know what I've endured? You know the Papa, pain I've gone through? Please, no. Papa. Mm? David. Please. David. Papa. David. Please don't continue like this. Now, let's to you now. Please. Please. David. Papa, Papa please. David, please. Uh, no, David. Please. David, be gone. Oh, please. See her and your son, we are kneeling down, pleading, please. Okay. Hmm? Who will stay in that house? See how God has blessed us. Even our rent, we can't pay, we can't even feed well. The other children, you know how it is, even to pay school fee. You just moved Antonia to government school. How do we cope? Please. Please. Papa, please. Uh, what is there is this? I will call for a family meeting. There you go again. There you go again. The other time you called a mother for me. Now it's family meeting. For how long are we going to do this? Huh? For how long are we going to be swimming in family? Don't even know the situation we are facing today. If it's family that put us in this situation. And this opportunity comes but once. This is the opportunity. Please. I can't stay in that house alone. Please. However it is, just find a space in your house to just believe him. Please. We can't remain like this. Stop crying. Papa. Uh, like I have said, hmm? no, don't cry. Don't cry. Papa. I am not a wicked person. I'm not a wicked man at all. But the truth is that, as a Christian that I am, I have to live my life pure. Let me, let me call a family meeting. I know the family we come out from. So that we can put two good heads together and iron this matter. Because, oh, because. So if family decide you don't pack in, you won't pack in. Not yeah. that family will decide for me. But I need to see their opinion. So, you are trying to tell me you are not man enough. Why am I not man enough? Yes, now, because yeah. you want your family to decide for you. No, David, why am I not man enough? You know me now. How many families, those your you family, how many of them have you decided for? No, I want to know. Maybe I'm making a mistake. Let, just tell me to Is my Is it not my family? Am I not the one that came out of the, fa the family? We have a standard. standard. Yes. We, we have a standard in our family. Oh, nay. I am going to call this family meeting. 
I know the family I came out from. You I know, know the family you came out from? Yes. How many of your families have called you to come and arrange their house for them? Because I don't understand. Maybe you have another family somewhere. If it's the same family I know, how many times have they called you to come and amend their family for them? Since how many, that's two years that your son has been away. How many of them have given you 20 naira to go and eat? How many of them have paid your son's school fee? So now that my, has, my son has made it, you want to start bringing in your family. Your elder sister's son built a house. They didn't inform you, you had it from outside. Your brother's daughter that got married, they didn't tell you. They didn't call family meeting. They only brought Ivy. So now that God has blessed me, through David, you want to start bringing family. Wait, does it mean family is configuring your head? Because it's like I'm taking it lightly and you don't like it. No, Papa David, I can see that you are swimming in poverty. You want to die in poverty. Is that what you said? Yes. That's it's written all over you. Papa. Leave him, let him go. Mind. Go, make up your I'm mind. I made up my mind. Make Papa. it up. Papa. I have made up my go. mind. Papa. I'm going to call a family meeting. See poverty Papa. all over you. I don't even Papa. know what I saw in this man. I'm tired. Rubbish. Papa. I'm tired. Papa. Why are you talking to your husband like that? Didn't you hear him? Mama, I don't, I don't like the way you're talking to Papa. I don't like it now. Mama. Uh -uh. Okay, I should carry your father and pamper him. You don't like the way I'm talking to him. You don't... In fact, the whole world should hear me now. You push should hear me. You push should look at me now. I'll be fine, woman. But I've been suffering since I got into this man's life. So I should die in poverty. My husband doesn't understand. It's like his brain is formatted. He doesn't know what is called tech. He's asking me, where did he get the money from? My husband wants to remain. Your father wants to die in poverty. I think his family, they've for, for, formatted his brain. Yes, because if that man brain, they know man, he won't be behaving like this. Yours. You see what we are facing today? Till thy kingdom come, except your papa brain, they, they come out in brain, wash him, fix him back. That is when we'll get out of this poverty. But for me, oh, I've made up my mind. Except you to pursue me. You won't chase me away. You won't pursue me too, like your father. Leave your father now. Let him enjoy poverty. Let him enjoy. By the time he will see me in the next one or two weeks, Haba, he will join me. Relax. Hmm? My son, relax. Eh? Let's take it quick. Now, my husband, I know him. I know say my papa, oh, they're not my husband. Leave him for me. I go handle him. You see that family where you carry for head? When they go pour for ground, now that time I go start with her. No be now. Nah. Don't worry. You know? Your mama like you. Forget your papa. You know? Oh, go relax. Okay, mama. Auntie, thank you. We don't finish. Any other thing? Eh? I go pack and enter my son's house. Yeah. Don't I look good? You look good. I'm a fine woman, she? Yes. Thank you. Okay, Emma. So, I... I wish you all the best. Thank you. David. Mm. Love, Joe. I wish you all the best. I understand how you feel because you wanted your mom and your dad to be happy mm -hmm. moving into the house together. You understand? I understand how you feel, but everything will be fine, okay? Okay, ma'am. Thank okay. you very much, this anti-fine. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, you too, you're fine. Thank you. Let's go inside. Yes, sir. Hey, this is yours, mama. My house. 